Title, Zoom Zoom. JQ's charges up indoor tracks and breaks world records. TL, DR, British Formula E driver JQ's just shattered the indoor speed record, reaching 218.71 km per hour in London's Excel Centre. The previous record was 165.20 km per hour. This electrifying feat was done with the Gen 3 race car. But the question remains, can he top this next season? Deep inside London's Excel Centre, a space more commonly associated with conventions than crazy car stunts, a groundbreaking event took place. Jake Hughes, hailing from the UK and known for his Formula E prowess, has now added a new accolade to his name. A duel ensued between Hughes and Lucas Di Grassi, a Brazilian Formula E champ from the 2016-17 season. Instead of boxing gloves or a tennis court, this showdown took place on a 346-metre straight path inside the XL Center. Talk about a unique venue for some electric car action. But wait. Why was this showdown such a big deal? Well, Hughes didn't just try to outdo Di Grassi. He aimed to shatter a world record, and shatter it, he did. Remember the time when US driver Lee Keen zoomed through the New Orleans Convention Center in 2021 with a Porsche Taycan Turbo S, setting a record of 165.20 km per hour? Yeah, that was the number to beat. But there's a twist in the tale. Every record attempt has to meet some strict conditions. As for the sophisticated peeps at Guinness World Records, the car needs to start and finish its run from a complete standstill, and all the action has to be indoors. Sounds simple, right? But imagine hitting speeds of over 200 kilometers per hour indoors. Hughes, ever the professional, warmed up with runs of 214.80 kilometers per hour, 215.05 kilometers per hour, and 217.65 kilometers per hour. He described the experience as very fast, I mean, duh, with the Gen 3 race car screeching around the opening bend before it accelerated furiously down the straight stretch. Degrassi, not one to be left behind, showcased his skills with practice runs reaching as high as 218.18 km per hour. Can we just take a moment to appreciate that electrifying atmosphere? The hum of the car, the screech of the tires, and the thrilling anticipation of witnessing a new record. It's a gearhead's dream. However, even in such intense duels, there's only one who takes the crown. In this case, it was Hughes. He set a blistering pace of 218.71 km per hour. Yep, you read that right. That's faster than most of us drive on highways, and he did it indoors. This electrifying event was just a precursor. The Excel Center, with its sprawling 2.09 km track, will be hosting the final two rounds of the season over the weekend. And if this record is any indication, the upcoming races are sure to be thrilling. So, as we gear up, pun intended, for more exhilarating events, one thought remains. With drivers like Hughes pushing the limits of what's possible in the world of electric car racing, where do we go from here? And more importantly, will anyone dare to challenge Hughes' newly set record next season? What's your take?